Yes. Let me tell you about my daughter's case. The post, when the body had gone for postmortem, without before postmortem it was declared suicide, and after postmortem, when the doctor said it is due to asphyxia, asphyxia due to hanging. So police used that word asphyxia to support the suicide story. Now under that suicide, they use they start covering up everything. Asphyxia is something that can happen due to drowning, due to strangulation, due to suffocation. It can be homicidal and suicidal. In Gia's case, the doctor experts have clearly said the injuries that were on her body and on her face was not due to the soft muscle in the patta. JJ Hospital themselves in the postmortem report wrote that all the injuries on Gia's body were anti-mortem, means caused before death. So that means that somebody had killed her or incapacitated her and then hanged her, strangulated and then hanged. So it is a staged homicide. But in Gia's case, the ligature mark and the blunt object that was round, that was very sharp, was not consistent with a soft dupatta because the ligature marks were very sharp and running parallel throughout uh, around the neck. So that's not caused with something as soft as this because these have no edges and it cannot cause that parallel, sharp parallel, parallel lines. Similarly with Sushant's, which I saw the picture today, it doesn't look that it has been caused by fabric. Fabric does not create those kind of imprints. Now, JJ Hospital doctors themselves said they cannot give cause of death, a final cause of death, still pending, because the ligature has not been given to them. Uh, if they would have given ligature, obviously they would have verified it, analyzed it, whether it was possible, uh, you know, for these injuries to be caused with this ligature. But, you know, it seems everything is being managed. The JJ hospitals are being managed. Police is being managed. So somebody is managing this. And it is very really sad that we have got to live in a place where we are looking up to police to give us answers, to help us, to protect us. And they are the one who is going to be, you know, not solving our problems. Then who do we go to? We don't have anyone. We have got just ourselves. It has become police's practice that every death they see by hanging, they say it's suicide without investigating, without finding out and believing in what other people are saying.